Uh, as you point out, it could be one of the coldest home games in Buffalo Bills history. So how should fans prepare for all of this? Well, Natalie Kutchko breaks down what you need to know if you plan to go there and brave the cold. I have socks on, but I'll get my thermal boots. I'll get my Gore-Tex boots and put my boots on. Before I do that, I put some insulated Craig socks. Whipple is familiar with the cold. He's a longtime lacrosse coach, but above all, a devoted Bills fan. With temperatures hovering around zero for Saturday night's playoff game in Orchard Park, Whipple says you have to be prepared. Under concerns of frostbite, that includes layer upon layer. You have to stay warm. Once you get cold, you're going to be cold the rest of the day. So you want to stay warm right from the get-go, and you want to keep moving around. The biggest thing, and in, in, in probably with the Bills team and the, even the fans in Buffalo and, and what we do as coaches, is preparation is everything. Tammy Boglioni of Canandaigua will be rooting for the Bills from the seats. Well, it's part of living here, you know, we're used to this kind of weather. This is bitter for sure. A season ticket holder, Boglioni says she wouldn't miss it for anything. You know, it's this playoffs. I mean, it's all or nothing now. You know, you be there be square. For those who will be in attendance, doctors urge you to dress as warm as can be and take breaks in heated areas if possible. And a word of caution for tailgaters. The big thing with the alcohol response is it really decreases your shivering response. Um, so it doesn't really have the body's, it, it eliminates the body's innate protection against cold because um, shivering will help keep you warm. So you may feel like you're warm, uh, so alcohol may mute that, and it's also affecting your body and how it deals with the cold. Um, so it just puts you at, at higher risk. If we're going to the game, the biggest thing is we got to put our jerseys on. Keeping a strong mental perspective, Whipple says, is also important for both fans and players. Don't think about the weather. Don't let the weather affect you mentally. You just go do how you no do in a normal game, and and try and help the Bills win and go get a victory. Natalie Kutchko, 13 Wham News. Craig is all set and ready to go. By the way, I did check the website today. If you like those electric uh, socks and gloves, can't wear that. Anything battery operated, not permitted at Highmark. We've also seen on social media some fans selling their tickets in light of that forecast. Mike, by the way, will update the lineups and injury lists a little bit later in sports.